Rod Fast! Yeah! from Johnny Likes Noise. What does it take to be in a band, man? You need, you need to have balls. Don't wait for it to happen. Go out, find the right people you want, get on the goddamn stage and do your own music. So you guys write all your own stuff, right? We do all our own stuff. We don't have to nuke all the cover bands, but they can only take you so far. Do your own stuff. It's like a painting. Do your own painting. Don't That's paint right. someone else's painting. Do your own painting. That's right. You're never going to be a rock star if you're in a cover band. No, it's not going to happen. You heard it from Clown Boy, man. Aaron's partying over there. <laughs> Woo! I am here with Wendy from yes. Sunspot. She just played a set. It was amazing. <laughs> She's the crazy. drummer. Oh, thank you. Number one advice for any band that wants to do any kind of touring, I would say, is don't skimp on your band van. The band van yes. is important! You're, you're basically going to be living in it. And yeah. if it rusts out to the point where you can see the highway, that, chances is that bad? are it's bad actually. It's bad! It turns out that that Craigslist van you buy really cheaply <laughs> might end up like ruining your you know opportunities yeah, for yeah, shows yeah, and yeah. stuff. That's the advice that I wish someone had given me when we yeah. were early in our career. But uh, all right, so the also, man is not a hairstylist. Yes, a hairstylist. <laughs> hairstylist is good. All right. Thanks so wow. much. Yeah. 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 I'm here with Kevin, ex-bass player for Full, Full Devil, Devil Jacket. Jacket, one of my favorite <laughs> bands back in the day, back in the 90s, right? Yeah, yeah 90s, yeah. 2000, yeah. So you, you guys toured for a while, right? Obviously yeah, we were out bands. Yeah, about three years. We did everything from... Uh, Opening slots from Creed to uh, Typo Negative. You typo, ne typo Negative. That was our yeah. first run. Was the first nice. run we ever did was Typo Negative. Yeah. Rest yeah. in peace, Peter. Yes, Peter Steele. We love you. Do you have any advice for people starting out? It's just always promote, 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 and then promote some more. To me, it's like everywhere you can stop, make a flyer, put it in a music store, social media, network with every band you can find. A lot of you get in a lot of situations where some bands and they don't want to talk, or they there's yeah, that yeah. Comp the competition shit going on, and don't don't get caught into that. Hell yeah! Every band out there is your best friend. They can be your best friends, you're their best friends. Promote each other, work together. Find some bands that work with you, same style. Book the same shows together and work together. Because it's 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 a it's a dog eat dog world. And if you don't have if you don't have friends, right on. And, and so your other network. band, other, yeah, network, network is, network is everything. That is the key, especially now. And then again, like I said, social media, utilize it. Follow your favorite bands, tag everybody, tag tag companies you use, the gear you use, tag them in all your posts. You never know, they'll share a picture every once in a while, it can make a large bit of difference. It makes oh, a yeah. big difference. Alright. Well thanks Kevin, oh, it was thank good talking to you, man. You too, man. Yeah. All enjoy right. the enjoy the heat. Hell yeah. <laughs> Those are the Budweiser Clydesdales. I wonder wow. if they can give me an autograph. Barrett. Barrett. Yep. Torian. 
Look at you. Yeah, chin down, eyes up. Chin That's down. the, the yeah, badass yeah, yeah, way to look. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> I am here with Fang Van Rothenstein. What's up? From Lords of the Trident. Which is I. Torian? Baron Torian. LSR. LSR. I saw you on stage, you had armor on. Mm -hmm. You were looking badass. <laughs> I am here with Baron Falk Torian. <laughs> so you had a freaking sword, a freaking trident, an axe. Yep. It was insane! Baron Torian Pelasar of Lords of the Trident. What is going on, man? Do I have Fang any advice? Fang Van Ravenstein is holding the selfie stick right uh. now. So we're here today, Baron, because we want to help the aspiring rockers. Okay. We want to help them figure out like what they need to do to be a successful band like Lords of the Trident. Maximal man. rocking capacity. Yes, absolutely. If there's one piece of advice that I'd say for new bands, uh, learn how to screen print. It wow, is super a... duper duper easy. Cut, cut, cut! Alright. Alright, All right. he got a phone call from, from some douche. From Bill. From some, Bill. Some, some douche. douche that came to this festival with me. Some douche! <laughs> Stop calling. So, um, we make all of the band shirts ourselves. It costs us a fraction of what it would have cost to go um, have somebody else do it. And literally, we make them out of like old, like, grandma negligee and, and wood. Do you have like one piece of advice? Write the best songs possible. Write the best songs possible. Now, I obviously I'm sure Ty told you very different things. Um, Ty just said print your own t-shirts, man. I'm that was his advice. Right. Just print your own t-shirts and you're uh, good. You know, t-shirts and songs second, <laughs> I guess. I don't know. Uh, <laughs> about people that are like traveling, touring. If I could give one piece of advice for touring bands, uh, it is this. For the love of God, go buy inflatable air mattresses. You can get self-inflating air mattresses on self -inflating Amazon. Self-inflating on Amazon. For $30. $30! Because, you, because look, when you go on tour, <laughs> you're gonna be sleeping in the worst, most disgusting places. You're gonna be sleeping in you know, bar floors, random people's houses, wherever we are, it doesn't matter. We just plug in, air up, and then boom, we have a really pleasant night's sleep. Even if it's on the grimiest, dirtiest floor, even if we're on dirt. We $30, can, we, man. We you and can it, be sleeping in luxury. Yeah. That is very valuable advice yeah, yeah, yeah. from Fang Van Raffenstein. Yeah. Sweet, man. Thank you, Mr. Fang. <laughs> yeah! Now, how long, how long have you been playing guitar, man? Um, it'll be 23 years. Do, do you suggest people get lessons or can they learn from books or like YouTube? Like what's the best way to learn guitar? Come have lessons with me. I this guy lessons. teaches lessons. Um, I mean there, there are a million resources out there. Uh, books are good, YouTube are good. The only problem with those things or even doing like the Rocksmith thing is it's one directional. You, know, you can look at a, at a video or whatever and learn things off of it. Yeah, yeah. But if you're doing something wrong, you're not getting feedback to tell you that, right. other than your own ear. Yeah, because uh, a lot of people, a lot of people are just starting out, you know, and they maybe they haven't developed that ear yet. Right. You know? or, or then like or picking technique or yes. you know left hand curving the finger, fretting yes. hand fingers, or, or any of those things. It, those are things that sometimes you don't realize you're doing in a strange or weird way or in an ineffective way until someone else. Uh, kind of points it out to you. Did you take lessons or? Did, or... Um, I took down, I took lessons for about six months when I started, and my teacher said, "I'm done. Get out of here." Well, okay. The thing about Mr. Barron here is he is like one of the most talented musicians you will ever meet. Right, so he only took lessons for six months, but that does not mean. That all you guys should just take lessons for six months. Uh, 
hard work can trump work. talent. I treat my guitar playing like my day job because it is. Nice. Uh, uh, honestly, I spend more time, way more than 40 hours a week, playing, rehearsing, doing all of those sorts of things. And I think in the long run, if you work hard and you work effectively and you work efficiently, um, that will absolutely trump someone who, who has a lot of natural talent but doesn't try or give Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, um, work hard. Um, right on, You need brother. to be kind of a weird dude, though, to play guitar <laughs> as obsessively as I do. So yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, brother. I think that's all I got, man. Cool. Man. Thanks a lot, Baron. I can't remember the rest of it, so I'm not... All Thanks good. a lot, Baron. You were amazing You are most tonight. welcome, Striker. And, uh, so. I appreciate everything you do, man. And, Thank you. Uh, good luck in the future, brother. Thanks. You all too, right. man. Cheers. Thanks. Broadfest with a huge success! Wow! I, I talked to some bands. My friend Bill got really drunk. No. Billy boy had a good time at Broadfest. You don't even know it, dude. <laughs> dude. Aaron's the only one that has a brain left. <laughs> Aaron is the only one that has a brain left, Bill. So nothing's changed after all these years. So you say you want to be a rock star? Prove it! Subscribe, and don't forget to hit the little dingy bell thing.